Hey guys, it's Tommy CM. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another Planet Coaster Park Spotlight. As always, if you do enjoy the video, please do give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you are new, as it really does help me out. And also, if you do want me to check out any of your creations on the workshop, then do let me know in the comments down below. Today's spotlight is of a it's a recreation of a small section of Disney California Adventure Park. Um, this is called a Bugs Land. Uh, this was created by Mike17 um, and the description they've put says before the Avengers took over there was a land where bugs would play and have fun shrink down to the size of an ant and experience this recreation of a land that was from Disney California Adventure Park attractions include Flicks Flyers Francis's Ladybug Boogie Heimlich's Choo Choo Train Tuck and Roll's Driving Buggies and Princess Dot's Puddle Park um, so yeah, it's uh, like I say, it's not a uh, it's not a big spotlight. It's just a you know it's a small section of the park, but really really fascinated me on the workshop seeing this, um, and I love the idea that uh, I love the idea of, of shrinking down to go inside an area of a park. Um, I've not been to Disney's Cal to Disney California uh, Adventure Park, but I have been to Hollywood Studios and been in the Toy Story Land there, and the you know the, the shrinking down feeling in there is fantastic. So. Yeah, let's uh, let's go and take a wander and see what's around here. So obviously, straight away, all the signs and all these plants are super big. Um, you know the the way the way these plants have been done look look fantastic, um, and that along with the real plants uh, is a really really nice touch. I think uh, the the flies hanging off them there as well um, is a you know a really really nice build that is. Um, there you can see the detailing on that just fantastic and then obviously you've got the security cameras hidden in because it is a recreation of a real park so that's what you would get there um there's a toilet block here now as i say i've, I've not been to uh, the california adventure park so it's not something i can sort of say yep that looks spot on or anything but uh you know it, it does the uh, does the job there for a toilet block uh so i'm just trying to think of the best way to tackle this uh we will we'll go around to the left i think first uh, and then walk round. So, obviously, we've got more of the uh, more of the bugs hanging off the uh, hanging off the little plants here. And over here, we have Flix flyers. Now, that is a fantastic build of Flix face. Um, I I haven't seen this on the workshop. I don't think so. I'm assuming this is. I'm assuming everything built in here is original. Um, in which case, yeah, again, superb. Um, you know, love. Love the way that's been done, and it's it's quite a simple but effective uh, effective model of of uh, Flick's face there. So uh, yeah, really really nice. And there you can see the ride. So it's just kind of surrounded by trees, etc. And it's the uh, it's one of the balloon rides, which everybody loves. Everybody loves the balloon ride. So uh, yeah, as as you can tell, I'm in plip cam mode as well, just so I can get the uh, the sort of the zoom in and zoom out feeling. Um, and I can also sort of feel shrunken into the park as well. Lots of over here. Look, we've got churros, and he's used the giant foods to again make make the guests feel small, which is really cool. Uh, Francis's ladybug boogie. There we go. We've got another flat right there, nicely uh, coloured in a black and red, for obviously for ladybugs. So uh, yeah, another another fantastic little ride there. Walk around here. Uh, we'll head over to the left in a moment. What's around this bit? Oh, oh, we've got a little splash zone. Look at that! <laughs> Lots of little fountains going off. This is one of those like areas, especially in America with the hot weather, um, where you obviously you know you get people running through there, trying to cool down or just trying to trying to not get wet, but ending up getting wet naturally. So that's uh, that's the track ride, which I think is probably the main attraction in here. So uh, we'll look at that at the end. Now if we get on this way, inside this little circus dome. Now I've not watched A Bug's Life in years, but I know that uh, they are like performing bugs, aren't they? Um, tuck and Roll's Driving Boogies. Or Boogies. Uh, which is obviously a Dodgems. So uh, yeah, very... Again, very, very nice. Nicely fenced off, and I love the, 
I mean, the, the building of the circus is really, really nice. Um, you know, as I always say, it's very difficult to to make a circular building in the game. Um, but I think this is a very nice way of doing it. And I like this board here, that you know, this green board that kind of blocks off anything behind there. Um, I think that's a very clever way of, of you know, of sort of doing that. So, yep, there's the, uh, there's the dodgems. And... I think we'll walk over this way and as we come around here that's the exit so we don't want to go that way we want to go around this way here we go Heimlich's Choo Choo spelt like that Choo Choo train so we'll go down here through the queue line again you, f you feel so small with these plants it's really simple but effective the way the way they've been done. I love it. So uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll hop on here. Like, oh no, we don't want that one. I'll uh, I'll back out and uh, make sure I'm picking the right train. There we go. So that's what we want. We want train two and we want to face forwards. That's what we want to do. So these guys can hop on. Uh, is she blocking the view? I think she might be. So we'll, we'll go front bumper. So uh, yeah, enjoy uh, Heimlich's Choo Choo Train. There we go, really, really nice, simple, but um, really, really nice ride that. And I tell you what, the detailing on it, you know, with these, uh, you know, like the rotten apple there, um, and the watermelon, you know, the eaten watermelon, that is really, really clever. What is this you've used here? Temple block. Wow, that is, uh, that's very clever. I mean, you know, the, the whole the whole theme there. Obviously, it's a recreation, so the, you know, the idea is is already out there. But I love the way that's been built on here. That is so so, like nicely done. And it looks it looks so genuine as well. Uh, and then we came through here. Uh, I'm not sure what's in this building. I don't know whether there could be a little bit more decoration rather than just feeling like a bit of an empty box, but. I mean, as I say, I don't know what's in there normally, um, but I, I do like the use of the oversized food again, especially out here as well. Oversized food, oversized food, and uh, yeah, no, I thought that was a, I thought that was a really, really fun ride. That, and this, you know, this whole area feels like something that could really, you know, really be in a, uh, in a, in, a, in a, you know, in a park. And as I, you know, as I keep saying, it used to be at Disney's California Adventure, um, but I'd love to see a. I'd love to see an area like this in a Planet Coaster Park because I think it is so just really nice and subtle. Um, on PS5, as you can see at the bottom, there it takes up 19% on the build counter. It's a, you know it's a it's a fifth of the park, um, but whilst it takes up 19%, there's a lot of trees there, so you could probably take out a percent or two with the trees, but. I think it's just a nice sort of junior area area of the park. Not every park has to be full of, you know, huge attractions for thrill seekers. Some sometimes it is nice to see like people focus on like junior attractions and family rides, um, and done well. I think it's a very very nice um, you know very nice touch. So uh, yeah, no, really uh, really impressed with that. I, I just thought it was a really nice little nice little novel idea. Um, as I say, oh, I hope there's uh, this piece is missing the roof here. Look at that. Um, yeah, as I say, it's uh, I know it's a recreation, but it's just a really nice, 
novel idea to build um, build on Planet Coaster for sure. Um, so yeah, if you have in, uh, if you have enjoyed that, I'll leave the details to it in the description down below. I'm sure it will be on the front page of the workshop on PlayStation shortly. Um, I believe it's got over 200 downloads last time I looked. Um, and if you did enjoy the video, please do give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you are new. And other than that, I shall see you in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.